Uh, hi everyone. Today we will try to understand what is doc to wic and what are the different types. So doc to wic can be taken as an extension of word to wic. We were trying to find uh, an embedding for an entire sentence or paragraph or a document. Uh, so let's get started. It has two major variants. One is distributed memory. Uh, this is on the similar lines of CBAW. So like if you remember in CBAW, what you are doing is that we take up a sentence, uh, we take up a word, then eventually we try to take its neighboring words. We form up a training sa uh, sa uh, sample where the neighboring words of a particular word forms the speakers and the word, the center word uh, becomes our target to be, uh, for car to be predicted. Now in case of uh, doc 2 with distributed memory, uh, the everything remains same as we did in CBAW, just that one more input, one uh, like uh, we were having all the neighboring words to predict the uh, to predict the central word. We will have one more input into that. That would be the paragraph ID. Uh, so if we have some sentence, so we'll be giving it some paragraph ID and uh, following any method that depends upon you. And eventually, uh, that paragraph ID would also be fed up alongside all the neighboring words. And we will try to predict the central word. Uh, in case of distributed bag of words, this is something very similar to skip grams. So in case of skip grams, if you remember, so what you are doing is that uh, in, a, in a word, we are taking all its neighbors and then feeding all these neighbors one by one, one at a time as an input and getting a particular word as an output. Uh, so uh, if a word has three neighbors, if we are considering three neighbors, so a, this will form three samples. Uh, one the first word as an input and the central word second word as an input second neighbor as an input the central word third word as an input the central word now in case of this we will add one more iteration that is paragraph id and the central word so paragraph id would go as an input and eventually we will get the for the predicted well the central word as an output uh, out of this skip gram model so the architecture also remains the same in case of both distributed memory and distributed bag of words it's just that we're adding in more iteration of paragraph IDs 